Hi, is this Evan? Hey, yes, sir, it is. Uh, I want to thank you for uh, just taking a little time of your day to do this interview. Oh, no problem. Okay, I'm going to first start it out on how did you fall in love with the game of football, and how did you know that someday you would want to play in the NFL? Uh, well, my uh, dad was a uh, coach, so I've been around him my entire life. And uh, ever, ever since I can remember, I've always loved uh, camaraderie that comes with it. I've loved the competition, and... Uh, I mean, I started from a very early age, and I've just been very fortunate enough and uh, lucky enough to have a chance to play at the next level. You were named the 19th best center coming out of high school and received a bunch of honors and were recruited by some big schools. Why did you choose Ole Miss? Um, ultimately, I wanted to play in the SEC, and I really liked uh, when I met with Coach Nutt. I really liked him, and uh, I liked the staff, and I love the, the campus. It's beautiful. And uh, it just was over. It was over. It was a really, really good fit. You made 40 career starts at Ole Miss and helped produce two of the top three seasons in total yardage at Ole Miss. How were you guys able to do that? With uh, Coach Freed's new offense, it, uh, it helps us a little bit. We uh, attack. We attack, we attack defenses a little differently. Um, also, the teammates uh, we've been with them. We had we had a lot of seniors uh, playing the uh, last two years. And on the offensive line, it helps to. Uh, to be, you know, practice playing and practice with each other for, for five years, it, uh, it really helps because we understand each other and we're, all, we're, all, uh, really, we're on the same uh, level of uh, understanding with everything. I, mean, I think that was the main thing, just the, the compatibility. What was the most memorable moment in your college career? Uh, defeating LSU this year by, by the field level. And who was the best player you faced? in my freshman year, um, and I'd also say uh, uh, I was, uh, a kid from Georgia, I don't know his name, but I know his number, he was 56, we played him last year, and he, he was one of the best defensive tackles uh, we, we just faced. You get off a double team, he was a hard hustler, he was a really good player. Uh, describe how your pro day went, and uh, how did the team meetings go there? What would you say your strengths and weaknesses are as a player? I would say uh, my strengths would be understanding of the game. I felt like uh, I, as a center, uh, was uh, pretty good at getting everybody on the same page. And uh, I think the things I need to work on are uh, my strength, which I have been the entire all season, and uh, footwork, which I have been. I, mean, I worked with uh, John Stitchman for a little bit in uh, Atlanta, and I felt like a lot of us have improved with uh, both of those. At the College All-Star Bowl and the Pro Day, what were you trying to prove to the staff, to the scouts? Uh, to how, to how I've improved my strength and my footwork. Uh, what, has, have any of former players given you any advice about the draft process? Uh, just John Stinson um, and uh, Terrence Metcalf, they talked to me just a little bit. Just uh, what, they, what, you know, what happened with them, how, how they did things like that. And it, it was all good advice. Why should an NFL team take a chance on you? I'm a hard worker. I'm a uh, very dependable guy. I'm not going to let this down. And one more question, just a little off the topic. Uh, what would, well, who's your favorite music artist and your favorite hobby outside of football? Favorite music artist? Uh, honestly, anything is easy listening. I really don't have an artist. Uh, I'll listen to anything. I mean, it goes from country to rap to house I, it doesn't matter uh, as long as it's good music i'll listen to it um, and uh, my favorite hobby would probably be uh right now uh shooting pool and uh playing uh just, just, you know, just play like tag football 